shortly after dropping my last video. I logged in to find some big time hillbillies who wanted to help speed up the process with my new account. These cowboys probably realized that it was going to take me decades to make enough money to train up this shitty account and wanted to donate to the savage prophecy. I would tell these Tim McGraw cowboys that I was thankful for these donations, but in reality, I was fucking disgusted. Only 40 million coins? Tim Allen biker boys make more than this in a day. Wow. After scamming those two dipshits, I headed out to the bandit camp, where I planned on wasting as much money as possible to train up my shitty account, and hopefully reach the goal of 60 ranged. While I was streaming myself kill these terrorists, I was approached by yet another dumbass, who wanted to give me some savage gold. Is that all you got little Billy? Wow. Go back to the bank and grab me the rest of your money. No matter how much money I scammed from these cowboys, I still never felt satisfied. In fact, I just wanted more, more money, more gold, more coin. Until my cash stack is completely maxed out like Spark Mac Boy. With the combined total in all the donations, I received over 70 million savage coin. Which should be enough for me to get this account into pretty good shape. The first thing I did was waste a lot of money on dragon bones, and trained my prayer up to 60 with the quickness, then I purchased a Craw's bow, because I always wanted one, and let me tell you boys even with a low ranged level it fucking destroys. I started gaining levels like a madman. Nobody could keep up with my massive XP gains and my massive bow. And before I knew it boys I was doing one of the most annoying quests in the book. Yup that's right boys. Dumbass brain numbing monkey shatness, and let me tell you boys. Nobody, and I mean nobody, hates doing quests more than me. But I knew the massive gains that came with the quest were a must. Look at all the gains I made by completing that quest boys, my stats are getting almost too powerful. It's to the point that I'm not even sure if playing this account anymore is even safe. Jagex probably thinks I'm a bot, due to the fact that my account's gains are so massive. Wow. But that's just the savage methods of a savage savage robot. And anyone who questions my methods will be slapped by my goons who I have on speed dial. Take a look at this next clip where I get one of the most impressive drops your eyes have ever seen. Oh wait what's this? Is that a dragon shield left half? Dropped from a dumbass mammoth? Yeah that's right boys. The luck on this account is unreal. There is no doubt in my mind that we have some massive massive drops coming in our near future. I then decided to do one of these brand new beginner clue scrolls. This casket is going to make us rich boys let's take a look boys. Are you fucking kidding me Yagex? 7 sardines? 5 cabbages? And a steel full helm? This has to be the worst clue scroll reward I have ever received in my life. Looking back at it I bet that dragon shield left half completely destroyed my RNG for the next 10 months. God damn it Yagex. You always find a way to kick me when I'm down. But even that won't stop me from turning this account into an absolute brute. Let's see if we get a triple chest boys. And of course, we do not. Wow. To sum up this account, I would say that it's still big time garbage. However, we are on the right path. We managed to get all the way up to level 81 combat. Not to mention 72 ranged, 50 slayer, 60 prayer, and 45 crafting. Wow. Hopefully by next week's episode we will actually be slapping up some goblin boys in the wilderness. Bone down the almighty mystic douche.
for thy will slap you with ten thousand chops to the chest for even questioning any of my savage methods. But in the meantime I think we should hop on over on Twitch, and take a look at what the savage goons have been doing in the depths of the wilderness. Yeah that's right lads, for those of you who still didn't realize, 25 buttholes is now officially live on Twitch. And we just unlocked the wow emote, and the savage robot emote. Now please, without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy the gun show. We got him on the run boys, I repeat, we got a Zezima cowboy on the run. This cocky Zezima boy thought that he was safe to lurk around in our wilderness while listening to Tim McGraw's greatest hits. A crime which is punishable by death. These Zezima boys may be safe when they are with the clan of massive nerds, but when we catch ya slipping by yourself brah this is what's going to happen every time brah. Take a look as this rat panics worse than a startled cow in a hailstorm. You can try to escape all you want Zezima boy, but your 99 defense is no match for our powerful dragon spear special attack. Slap him boys slap in. We have to drop him before he decides to put on his maroon 5 CD. Wow. My pistol gripping goons were letting off shots in all directions. I can only imagine how fast this nerd's heart was racing in this exact moment. He probably almost had a heart attack. Wow. Bye bye you know life god wars Tim McGraw cowboy. I hope you have a fun time yelling at the top of your lungs as you sit in the garbage castle of Lumbridge with all the other brainless cowboys listening to Billy Ray Cyrus and Tim McGraw. Ha 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 ha, wow. Now now boys, the moment we have all been waiting for. Grab your dad's cigarettes, grab them lemonade for locos, and grab them bottles of Listerine. Now mix all of the savage ingredient into a boiling pot of water. Mix the ingredients boys mix them in. This is how you make a real life attack. Oh, now attack your computer with a sledgehammer. Bruh, this is what's going to happen every time, bruh. Wow. Light them up, boys, light them the fuck up. This goblin boy right here is the prime example of being at the wrong place, at the wrong savage time. This angry wanker was trying to get back to his clan of Zezima boys, but got caught lacking with the quickness. How many times must we remind you cowboys that these streets are not safe? Do you know where you are little Billy? This is Rompton, home of the pimps, hustlers, and killers. Just because you bought a max to count on Craigslist doesn't mean that you have the green light to loiter around my wilderness listening to Creed and Nickelback like a dumbass chat. That rat got clapped so hard that he even died with a little big of hit points. Even Yagex knew this guy was fucked and wanted to help put an end to his misery. Wow. Good fight you dumbass 5 hit point rat. Have a fun time wanking it up in the streets of Chickenville. And no I'm not talking about Edgeville. I'm talking about dumbassville. Ha 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 wow. Now tell me boys. Do you hate Zezimo boys? Do you hate RuneScape 3? And do you hate dumbass bald bots, with green pants, and sketchy goatees clogging up the wilderness? Then how about you join 25 Buttholes clan chat today? 
where you will get the chance to make a difference in your community and slap these goblin rats live on tush. It's time that you take a stand in your pathetic life. For fuck's sakes John you are nearly 30 years old. How about you do something in your life that's actually productive? Instead of peeing all over yourself while you brainlessly watch your account train fishing. Join the Savage Army today boys. If Yagex is not going to take a stand to these underground terrorists, then the Savage Robot Army will. Ha 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 wow.